also have Leo's. This is a reading for Leo, Sun, Moon, and Rising, and Venus for the week of September 2nd to September 8th. Um, now it's a general reading. It might be about love, it might be about money, whatever resonates with you, go with it, okay? Um, I just got this deck, guys. It's the Ukiyo deck. It's so beautiful. Um, now I'm just learning the Arcana, so bear with me. It might take me a little bit. Um, I have to flip through the book a little bit, but spirit picks the cards I just interpret them okay so let's get into the reading all right so the overall energy of the week you guys got the page of wands okay that's funny because well, who's did I just do cancer has got theirs in the same spot So for the big, the beginning of the week, y'all got the Hierophant. Middle of the week, y'all got the Nine of Cups. That's cute. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. A end of the week, Knight of Swords. I'm sorry, the weekend. I've got the Page of Pentacles. Fetty Spaghetti. So let's clarify everything. Page of Wands for the week. You guys got the sun with the Page of Wands. Some type of healing is going on. Okay, okay. Spiritual healing. The Hierophant, you guys got the Five of Wands. Man, do y'all guys see how beautiful this deck is? Like, I cannot make this up. I'm so excited to be using this deck. But I'm not excited that I don't have, like, four arms right now to, like, keep everything in place. Like, come on, man. Two. Oh, y'all got the Emperor with the Nine of Cups. Knight of Swords, you guys got the wow, I'm not I'm not a good counter. Two, four, six, eight of cups. There is a lot of water energy. It's funny because in Cancers there was a lot of fire, and in y'all's there's a good amount of water. Leo's. And then with the page of pinnacles, you guys got the Knight of Wands. So good amount of fire and water energy. All right, so let's get into it. So for the overall energy of the week, you guys got the Page of Wands with the sun. So let us see, let us see, let us see. Sorry, guys, my uh, storage got used up. I don't know how. Like, I literally just cleared it up just before I came out here, but whatever. Okay, so you guys are showing up in your reading. Um, the sun, because Leo rules the sun leo is the sun so yeah a faithful loyal person with the page of wands and then um with the sun you guys get it's love it's happiness pleasure warmth something new um that's the energy of this week is something new so you guys are coming into your spirit um this week which is beautiful Look at this. Look at y'all. Alright, so the beginning of the week, you guys got the Hierophant and the Five of Wands. Hierophant. Hierophant. Now, the Hierophant speaks of, like, a spiritual leader. Um, and then, with the Five of Wands... somebody a good person um, a religious person a spiritual person somebody of like 
importance. With the five of wands, it means struggle, some type of entanglement, some type of obstacle. Now, you must be in the energy of humility to deal with this obstacle is what I'm getting at the beginning of this week. Um, now, you know what to do because you are spiritual um, and you know to be kind in the face of opposition because there might be some struggle, some type of opposition in the beginning of the week. In the middle of the week, you guys got the... The Nine of Cups. Sorry. With the Emperor. So with the Emperor. The Nine of Cups with the Emperor. The Emperor. Where are you at, Emperor? So the emperor speaks of having some type of authority, some type of... Wow. Okay. <laughs> so I'm back. Sorry about that again. So, okay, you, got the, you guys got the nine of cups with the emperor. Speaking of coming into some type of success, some type of worldly success, um, something that's going to be emotionally fulfilling but also physically fulfilling. Now you see how he's sitting on his throne, the emperor. Um, people, he's he's waiting for, he's just sitting around, people are watching him. And it makes him happy, he's a Leo, Leo's love attention. So yeah, y'all are coming to some type of something, some type of, uh, some type of something, something amazing. Some, it might be emotional, it's gonna be emotionally fulfilling, some type of stability, some type of wealth. And it's going to be abundance for you guys, some type of success. So y'all, wow, that's awesome. Okay, so the end of the week, you guys got the Nine of Swords with the, was it the Eight of Cups? Two, four, six, eight, yes. So Nine of Swords with the Eight of Cups. speaks of some type of bravery and then the eight of cups we're talking about overcoming some disappointments overcoming some type of shyness you have to be brave this is saying something about you guys being brave at the end of the week so it has to do with some type of emotional fulfillment something that you guys want emotionally you guys have to be brave enough to attain it now with the knight of swords you guys are going towards it swiftly um right here you guys are going towards something that's going to emotionally fulfill you now by the weekend you guys got the page of pentacles with the knight of wands um wow this is there's a lot of movement forward movement so by the weekend okay sorry that i just Wow, why did I sound out of breath? Page of Pentacles with the Knight of Wands. Okay, let's see. Page of Pentacles. I just get really excited when I do these readings, and I'm just like, <sighs> at the end, or like when something's about to come to me, and I'm about to like tell y'all something. I'm just like, okay, I gotta calm down a little bit because I'm finna, I can't pass out. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so Page of Pentacles talks about some type of reflection um deep concentration and then the knight of wands we talk about uh, page let's have a lot of night energy as well so the knight of wands speaks of going into the unknown now y'all are reflecting on everything that's gone through and y'all know y'all need to move forward now 
it takes like I said you have you guys are trying to y'all y'all are summoning the strength and the courage to do it because with the sun it speaks of fulfillment it speaks of you guys getting what you guys want so you guys are y'all are being the bearer of news um y'all know that something needs to change and y'all are making that change um now it, whether it be a, anything love um change of residence change of jobs anything y'all know that y'all have to go through with it there's no it's in the stars man and it's gonna give you guys emotional fulfillment on all levels so i love you guys and i'll talk to y'all later